I'm Rachel and welcome back to my channel Bales 1986 SW and today is Friday finds so let's get straight on to it however this is slightly different I'm going to mention in here um, some of my April favourites as well so two for one this time so let's get straight into it um, let's start with ice lollies the weather is getting a little bit better um, saying that it's a bit cloudy today but let's start thinking positive that the sun will come out and when it does, we will be prepared. Um, these are the new Robinson's Ice Lollies. They are three and a half sins. Please check any um, sins I mentioned on the app or the calculator. I can get it wrong and Slimming World um, like to update their app constantly. So these at the moment are three and a half sins. Um, these are the summer fruit barley ones. You get three in here, they are full size and they are absolutely delicious highly recommend them i haven't tried the next brand the, the next box but i know they're going to be a firm favorite these are the orange and apple and black currant mini fruit shoots um lolly ice lollies these are one and a half sins um, um an ice lolly they are absolutely delicious one and a half or two please double check um but i know they're quite low in sins um and they're absolutely gorgeous really really nice the children love them i love them so yeah i love them um i bought these from okado i have seen them in asda morrison's and sainsbury's so yes um the other one is i'm going to mention this just because um for anyone out there who suffers with allergies these are gluten dairy and nut free ice lollies um they're called lickalix and um, we call them mr men lollies you do get three in a box to do citrus flavour which is this one and do strawberry and um, they are 199 slightly high on the price point but they are two and a half sins let me just double check three the three sins a lolly sorry three sins a lolly they are really nice my daughter likes them i haven't personally tried them but three sins for a full size lolly um, and if you do have allergies then they, these are amazing highly recommend those this is next is just going to be a grab and i'll show you so they're not in any particular order the other thing i have been loving are these these are the new sea brooks um fiery wood smoke barbecue now if you like kfc like we all probably do um, and you want to do a fake away then you can i use a packet of these which are six and a half sins so you get a packet of these you crunch them up you fry like some mini chicken fillets you roll the fillet in the crunch version of this up um, and then you bake them in the oven and you I then stack them in a bread bun which is a healthy extra um, B with lettuce tomatoes a little bit of mayo ketchup you could use um, like a burger sauce for a little bit more sins uh, sorry about that um, and it's absolutely delicious it's like a really good fake away for a KFC um, from a KFC um, really like them and because like you can use the Doritos as well but these I like the barbecue taste to these it's like a barbecue taste with a little bit of a hint of spice and I highly recommend those um, the other thing these are an April favorite but I haven't showed them as a Friday find these are the Kiddelicious Veggie Straws. You'll find these down the baby aisle. But I really, really like them. They are three sins a bag and I, I just thoroughly enjoy them. There's no shame in it. I absolutely love them. I love these with hummus. Um, yeah, love them. and they're cheap and cheerful. And yeah, I can't say anything more. They are Veggie Straws. They are three sins a bag and I personally love them sticking with baby item food and um, these are the organics people now with okado sometimes you get a free item to choose from and um, this was the free item i got given um last week on my order and oh boy i've did i love them so i've repurchased another packet these are the organics finger foods pea puffs so it's like the aldi version of them they do them as well I really prefer these. These are three cents a bag um, and it's a 15 gram bag. I just like them. I really, really like them. They're three cents. They're low in cents. Um, yeah, I, I truly, truly love them. And I do take these out of the bag uh, and put them in a little sandwich bag when I'm eating them out in public. Just because the baby food. 
but I really, really like them. My other spring favourite, and it's a Friday find as well, that's spring favourite, April favourite, is the Oasis Zero. Um, this is a summer fruit. I'm trying to keep away from fizzy pop, um, so when I'm out and about and I want to drink, uh, like grab something to drink, I am I always go for this. It's the Oasis Zero. I absolutely love it. It quenches my thirst really lovely, um, and it's just an, an alternative to fizzy pop. I don't particularly like water, so I've been having this. Um, the next things are these. These are the... I can't pronounce that. Waffleettes, waffletons, or oh, the little goodness they are. They are one and a half cents, two cents, two cents, two cents, two cents. A mini little wafer. Um, these are really nice for, with a cup of coffee and um, and a little uh, of a treat. Um, if I'm going into the cafe with the friends. Um, I take away the biscotti biscuit and I replace it with one of these um, just because I prefer this. You get a little bit of chocolate and you get a wafer. Um, I don't know if you can buy these anywhere else. I bought these from Okado. Um, I really, really love these. They are really, really nice. So, got them. Then I wanted some snack. Ta um, ta 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 ba. Um, I wanted some car snacks. Um, we'd ran out of our car snacks, what we have. So I want something a bit different. So I picked up these. These are the chocolate eclairs from Waitrose. Um, they are one and a half cent per chocolate eclair. You can buy the firm favourite of mine, which is the Cadbury's, but they didn't have them in stock. So I went for these. These are chocolate eclairs. These are really nice because you get the um, sweet fix and you get the chocolate fix at the same time. I really, And they last for so long. So highly recommend these. One and a half cents. Delicious. Highly recommend them. This is a game changer. I love skinny syrups. Everyone probably knows what a skinny syrup is. It's a brand um, of a syrup which is free on the Slimming World plan and you they have a variety of flavours. You can buy them TK Maxx. I buy mine from Amazon. There is another supermarket, another online store you can buy them from. Um, but they are absolutely delicious. You can use them in cork, you can use them in a variety of things. I personally use them in coffee um, to give me a sweetener. I've gone away from sweetener now and I use my skinny syrup. My favourite skinny syrup is the English toffee. That's the only one I have bought. I have bought the caramel one. Um, I do like that, but not in my coffee. Um, however, I've seen these about and I thought, you know what, I'm going to purchase myself one. The skinny syrup whipping foam game changer this is delicious this is free on the plant they come in uh, in lots of flavors this is the salted caramel flavor and it has changed my coffee game it is like my coffee game was eight this has made it like a 15 it is amazing highly highly recommend that you try this they come in different flavors like i said um there is a marshmallow one which i think i might be purchasing for like the christmas time and a hot chocolate delicious um it just gives me like a cappuccino and i am a cappuccino kind of girl but i'm not using milk or anything like that you just basically squirt it and it foams your coffee up Um, i really really like it it is game changing love this um, then going to chocolate, um, these are the green and black praline um, chocolates. These are quite expensive, they are £5 a bag. So if you've got a special lady or man in your life and it's their birthday and they're on Slimming World or it's Father's Day or something like that, then I highly recommend these. Um, these are two and a half cents per little green and black treats. They like, they taste like a, a bit of like a Ferrero Rocher um, effect. I absolutely love these. These are mine and mine only and delicious. They, they do do another brand which is green, another brand, another flavour which is green. I don't know what that flavour uh, that flavour is but I just saw these and divine and I really do portion these out and it's brilliant for anyone who, who finds portion controlling hard because they are individually wrapped. So highly recommend them. I highly recommend everything, but I'll say it anyway. It might annoy you, but I will say that after probably everything. Then I saw Joe New SW. 
if I've butchered your channel, Joe, I'm ever so sorry. It will be linked down below. She, I saw these in one of her hauls and I'm like, hello, why haven't I seen these before? I'm like a Cadbury's fan. Why have I have never seen these before? That's because they're not in the chocolate section. Oh no, they are in like where the ice cream cones are and the sprinkles and like the ice cream sauces, things like that. That's where you'll find these. You get 14 in a box and they are two sins um, a treat. I have run these through the sin calculator. They are 8.25 grams worth of just pure heaven. Um, I like these um, to crunch up and sprinkle on top of quark. Quark will be mentioned a lot because I am obsessed with quark at the moment. Um, and for two scenes, I think it's really, really nice. When it comes to winter time, because these will be a repurchase, this is an April favourite and also a Friday find. Um, these would be nice in a hot chocolate demonstrated there. So yeah, highly, highly recommend these. Like I said, I just keep saying it. Um, another um, April favourite have been these. These are the Kalo Pop. These are my firm favourite, the sea salt and lemon. Delicious. Just a different spin on a crisp. Um, really like these. These are four, four, four and a half cents um, a bag. Um, the only downside to these is they don't come in a multi bag. They only come in a big bag and I haven't got self control to even stop me or even portion control that out. I haven't got the time and I ain't got the willpower. Um, these are like between 87p and 92p a bag, which is slightly on the high side for what they are. Um, so I only buy these when they are on offer and okay dough. Um, but I really, really like these. Highly recommend them. Um, then my other spring favorites. Spring, fa I always say spring favorites. April favorites has been the Sweet Freedom Syrup, fruit syrup. This is gorgeous this is amazing don't worry guys i have got another bottle and um, i've just kept this to show you um is it is is it 15 no for a teaspoon of this it is half a sin i don't use a teaspoon i use a tablespoon for one sin i use this in quark i've used this in coffee and um, when my skinny syrup order hadn't come i've used this it's just so versatile. I've used this in sticky chicken instead of the honey, just to reduce the sins of it. It is delicious. I highly recommend this. Um, I think this is gonna be one of my top favorites of the 2018, um, because yeah, it's, it's just a repurchase for me. And I think if it's a repurchase, I've bought it twice in the month of April, um, because obviously I'm a bit obsessed with quark. So, I just think this will be like a repurchase for me and it will probably be a 2018 firm favourite. Highly recommend it. Um, then I did an Instagram live with Kate SW, link her channel down below, and there was a, a lady on there who wrote about peanut butter in hummus. Um, Kate, me and Kate are going to be doing an Instagram live. She's going to teach me part of my cook along series on Instagram lives how to do the um, hummus, um, some world hummus. And she said that she uses peanut butter. Um, and then a lady commented on that channel. I, I, I have honestly forgotten your name. So if it was the person who recommended this, then please comment down below so I can personally thank you. It has been a game changer. This is the PB Fit. Um, peanut butter powder and um, I've just got to check two tablespoons of this is two and a half sins you mix it with 20 mils of water and it makes the most delicious peanut butter I've had peanut butter on toast and um, I've had it in I have mixed it with quark I wouldn't do that again I just thought it'd be a little bit different um, it's really really nice and I've actually just made it up and stuck some carrot sticks in and just ate it peanut butter and carrot sticks with apple slices I've really really liked this um, and I've used it quite a lot and as you can see it looks, still looks a full tub um, just follow the instructions at the back and it is divine absolutely it's an April favourite and also a um, Friday find um, now these are my April favourites. The, and they are Friday Friends vlogs, I've not hauled them before. These are the Oreo birthday party. As you can see, I've opened these already. Um, this is my second 
packet of these in the month of April. Um, if you know me, you will know that I absolutely love Oreo birthday party. Now, there is, it is an American version, and I'm so glad they have come to the UK finally, because it is personally my favourite. Inside the Oreo, where it's the white, the white bit, it has like confetti, it has like sprinkles, and when you have it, it it's very, very sweet. Um, they are two and a half cents an Oreo. Um, I have crunched these up and put it on top of quark. Um, um, I just think they're really, really nice. They are nice for a coffee, a cup of tea. I just personally love these, and yeah, been my um, spring, um, spring favourite. April favourite. Then, last Friday find, I mentioned these. These are the Uncle Ben's flavoured bursts. And I had so many people commenting on them about the synage and things like that. So now I've physically got one, I'm going to tell you the correct sins. For the full pot of this, it is highly sinned. However, this is the katsu curry, my firm favourite. However, if you have a look, and you run this through the sink calculator, you will see that per 100 grams, it is 78 calories. So four sins it works out at. Now this pot is 150 grams. Now you, that is a lot of katsu curry. Now my portion of this, which will be 75 grams, which works out at three sins. That's why I sinned it at three sins. I do apologize if there was a lot of, I think it was because I said per pot and I meant to say per portion. Um, I do apologise about that. So it is it is meant to serve two, um, so it's six sins a pot. I send it at three sins. Um, I do apologise about that. Like I said, please check the Slimming World app. But for three sins, it, it goes so, it, oh, it just makes the gorgeous katsu curry. Um, I highly recommend it. Um, so yeah, it's been a firm favourite. And I've got quite a few of them. Then, I have changed my tomato ketchup. I like tomato ketchup with like my fried breakfast. And I, I didn't like using a lot of sins on it because I do like quite a lot of tomato ketchup. So I saw like Jane Day on her channel, link her channel down below, mentioned about something like this. So I investigated. Um, tomato ketchup, 50% less sugar and salt. Um, 15 grams of this, it says per portion, I've rang this through the sin calculator, 15 grams per portion is half a sin. Now, I think 15 grams is a tablespoon. So, let's just surmise that 15 grams is a tablespoon, because it could be more, um, is half a sin. So, I could have two tablespoons for a sin. That's a hell of a lot of ketchup in my mind. Um, so, I bought a big bottle of this, and this is going to be, going to be used from now on. Um, so yes, and then finishing off with my favourite word of the month is quark, quark. I've been obsessed with quark. These are the flavoured quark. I have said in the past all the green quark and the red quark. This is what I mean guys. This is what I call the green quark. This is the cooking cheese, garlic and herb and this is the tomato and basil. You can do so much with these. I personally just use them with pasta dishes and bulk them out with speed food, with protein and everything. They are once in a pot. My favourite other quark, which I've put away in the fridge and forgot to take out, is the Arla, the Arla brand, cooking cheese, fat free, plain. That I have with the sweet syrup, with lots of speed um, fruit, so strawberries, raspberries, blueberries. It's just been my favourite treat and I really, really like cork. So, yeah. So that is everything I liked in April. These are my Friday finds. Sorry it's a bit longer than normal. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this. So, food optimise when you can. Take care. Sending positive thoughts, Rachel. 